the, the service I have with Brand X right now, um, I bought my own router, and even the ones that they provide will do this. Whatever device I hooked up to it, a computer, um, a gadget, whatever it is, it requests an address via DHCP, and I'm handed a public routable IP address for my external interface and my, my own router. Um, is yours going to hand me something like 192, that whatever, or is it going to be a routable public? No, it, it, it'll be a routable public. Oh, good. It, we, it, we use... so. The standard we use now, just because of the IPv4 exhaust, is it we'll use carrier grade NAT, um, and, and so it's still a, a public IP address that you're getting, or, and, and you'll be able to route all that stuff. There may be some specific applications that you're going to want to use a, a, a static IP for, and, and as Nick said, those are available. You know, there's ways around that, but as long as I get my public on my device, I'm happy. Yep. <laughs> well, then you'll be happy. Is is there any plan, do you know, in in the internet community to stop supporting IPv4? I know we've run out of v4 addresses, and and theoretically, as soon as as soon as everyone switches to v6, we'll be okay. Uh, but it, what it took forty years to 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 get to v6 in the first place. <laughs> yeah, I I mean, I there there have been things that have been discussed over the years. And we, you know, we're handing out public IPv sixes, and and those are available, and, and that everybody's getting those. To place an order for service today, visit our website at greenlightnetworks.com. We'll see you next time.